hello guys welcome back to the channel today we are solving another lead code problem that is 930 binary sub arrays with sum in this problem you have to return the number of sub arrays with sum given and also the sub array not sub array the array will be containing zero and ones only let's take an example to understand goal is to let's make all the sub array that has some is equals to two first one is this another one is this and another one is this also zero zero one and another one can be this these are four sub arrays that has goal is equals to two or we can say sum is equals to two as given in the problem statement there are two ways one is hash map and other one is sliding window why hash map because you can just see if that sum appeared before if you have done that similar question of prefix sum type then you can easily do that and other one is sliding window the more intuitive one which can cross your mind when you see this type of this type of problem severe type because usually we do sliding window and severe type of question and now how we gonna apply that severe and uh, not severe the sliding window is we need exactly exactly sum k let's call it sum k exactly sum k but we know how to not we know but it is easy to count at most k isn't it at most k include 0 1 and dot 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 k so to get exact exact k we can do at most k minus at most k minus 1 very logical so how we gonna deal with this k or deal not not deal how we will be doing this counting of at most so let's take the example only let's take the example only this 0 1 0 1 and uh, the goal is 2 the goal is 2 increase increase the window window size till k and while increasing the size while doing the size do this and minus start this is very known thing how to cal uh, how to calculate total number of survey you need to use this discussed in on uh, in previous videos how how and why this works and when this happens what happens when some increase greater than k what to do decrease the size of window decrease the size of window size of window window till till sum is greater than k and after that again do the same thing count plus and minus start let's apply that same algo on this input one zero. write it more take more space that less error from explanation Goal is equals to two. This is valid. 
I will just run it for k and similar thing for k minus 1 and by subtracting the result of k minus k minus 1 result you will get the exact k let's do it I am only doing for goal is equals to 2 you have to do it also for goal is equals to 1 in order to get exact goal is equals to 2 this is at most at most at most this is exact so this counts plus 1 again this counts plus 2 again this counts plus 3 again this counts plus 4 now something to carefully watch when this happens we hit the condition now sum is greater than k we will decrease it but in the prop in the coding part you will see when this condition happened the end is all already beyond the size of the array beyond the index sorry if it is 0 1 2 3 4 it is now in fifth index when this, this condition hit and when the window size is decreased as we remove this one now our sum is again to 2 so the start is 1 and the end is 5 so what will be added is 4 5 4 how much is this it's 5 5 10 and 14 14 sim let's do it for one also for more clarity it was 101 sum is 1 count sum is still 1 again count i'm doing end minus start i'm not writing again and again i just cleared that over here it's very basic stuff now this time we we were counting for one it's two it's two it will decrease it will decrease again two again increase this time three again increase but but it doesn't go like that you need to have the sum one what would happen if it is decreased to this still the sum is two it is decreased to this now it is two and what will happen as you know in the end case the end is already is equals to five and we get out of the loop how much we are getting is 10 14 not 110 10 we get 4 subarrays as discussed in the answer this you need to watch yourself that when this condition happens the end is at out of the loop when end this last one is processed very basic thing why i am explaining i don't know so let me remove this well, that basic stuff at most goal and at minus at most goal minus one how we are calculating at most this is sum and start count count is end and count end start count where count is obvious thing count the number of so where is run the loop till end is less than the size and keep on increasing the sum and keep on increasing the end as you can see i am always increasing the end so even at fourth index when the last one is processed the end is already at five but 
before getting to 5 we encounter the while loop in while loop what is written is start should be less than end because it's very necessary condition for obvious reason and some should for how much long it should run is some should be greater than k and keep on minusing the nums from the start and also increasing the start and keep on counting and minus start and keep on ending into the previous count and return it calculate for at most goal minus calculate for at most goal minus one and return the answer you get the answer let's submit it and see for ourselves if it is running or not yeah it is running so i hope you learn something you get you can do by a hash map very easy store the sum uh, store the sum minus the target and if it appears again how many time it appeared again just plus it very basic stuff you can do it i why i discuss sliding window is because this is more generic stuff you can apply in many problems this same same because in interview it is not like you know how much it is like how much you can reproduce at that time so have the information in concise form so that you can reproduce in the given time interview again i am saying interview is not about how much you know interview is about how much you can reproduce at a given time so keep grinding you guys are awesome and i am rooting for you see you in the next one bye bye